Welcome back to Blitz. I'm Brian Carter again here at Dawson County High School. Now on the show with me, Jacob Evans. He is the senior captain here on the Dawson County Tigers basketball team. Jacob, uh, thanks for being with us here on the show. You're welcome. Uh, first of all, just start out talking about, uh, I talked with Coach Burr just a, a few minutes ago about the, the attack that you guys use in each game. You live and die by that three-pointer, and, and you got to love that because you're a pure shooter from beyond the arc. So talk about the three-ball attack and, and how much you like running that offense. I like the running the offense pretty good. we got a penetrator like Tyler Dominey who can pretty much get wherever he wants on the court. And that opens up the three for anyone who can shoot. And each year we just continue to make it. Now, have you had any uh, – I've seen games, I've been in many games where you start out from the get-go, you're just nailing your threes. But have you had any games where you kind of struggle to begin with and, and get frustrated? Gilmer, last game we had, I think I missed the first five or six of them. And then once I made a layup, I just – Felt like I was in a groove again, and I just started hitting them. Is that usually what you would go to, is try to maybe hit a jumper or something closer in to kind of get your rhythm back? Yeah, just get some confidence. Anything I can do to make a shot usually helps. Now, four years in a row, Dawson County makes state. So uh, you have a chance this year to make it every year you're here at the school to make state. So that's got to be a big goal in your mind. But each year you guys can't quite get past that first round. What are you going to try to do this year to get past that? I'll just try to practice more each weekend or whenever I can, and hopefully the other guys will come up here and shoot if they can too. Now we've seen uh, the region realignment. Uh, we talked about that just a few minutes ago um, with Coach Burgess about bringing in other teams. Uh, East Hall is the most notable one, I guess, that stepped in, Hart County. Um, those teams stepping in, have you seen – at this point, you haven't got a chance to play them with the region games, but so far this year, has its competition level look about the same as it has been? It seems like each team gets better each year, but as we work on it, we sort of do too, and hopefully we can just pull out a win each game. Now, do you have any uh, – you kind of touched on your team goals this year, but personal goals, what would those be this year? I've always wanted to break that three-point record here in Dawson County, which is nine, and I've always wanted to get ten just to break a record and have my name in Dawson County. I'm, I'm actually kind of shocked you haven't already because it seems like every game you hit hit about six or seven, it seems like. I don't know for sure. But um, where do you stand right now? What's the most you've made in a game? I've made nine in one game. So I've tied oh, the record. So you tied it. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Um, any other personal goals or anything like that you have? Just try to make it past the first round of state, maybe a little bit further before my senior year. Uh, now, since you are looming ahead right now is graduation for you, uh, you got to be at this point with your talent be considering playing at the mm -hmm. next level, correct? Yes. I've got a couple of calls from coaches in Georgia, but nothing for sure yet. Okay. Uh, well, last last question for you, Jacob, is just you guys seem like you got a pretty solid team with good chemistry, and, and that's important, making it into the state playoffs every year. Uh, how, how close are you guys as a group? We hang out uh, every weekend, it seems like, and just whatever we can. Just a good team, I guess. All right, well, Jacob, thanks for taking time out with us to be on the show today. All right, thank you. When we come back, we're going to have some other interviews for you, and later in the show, the Players of the Year for the Fall 2010 Sports.